Hey everyone, welcome to Judging for the Win. I'm Dave, and this is my daily ruling. Today's question was suggested by a viewer. Thanks to Get Agrippa for this one. Amy kicks Archangel of Wrath with a black mana. Can she kill White Knight with its ability? Okay, so to answer this question, let's first have a look at the relevant part of the comprehensive rules that describes exactly what protection does, and we can see something very interesting. The rules don't look at the color of the ability that's trying to target White Knight. Rather, they look at the characteristics of the ability's source. While it might seem natural to impute characteristics like color or color identity onto the Archangel of Wrath's kicker abilities, the game just doesn't work like that. When Amy says that she wants to target White Knight with Archangel of Wrath's damage ability, the game checks and it sees that this ability is from a white source, and White Knight has protection from black, so there's absolutely no problem with the target that Amy wants to pick. In the same way, damage that would be dealt to White Knight from black sources will be prevented, but Archangel of Wrath isn't black, so the damage happens entirely normally also. This works even if we're talking about spells rather than abilities. So, for example, it is possible to play something like In Thrall to the Pit against White Knight, even if you kicked it. And that's because a spell's color is just determined by the colors of mana symbols in its mana cost, regardless of if there were other colors that were spent to cast the spell. As far as the game is concerned, we're trying to target White Knight with a normal mono-red spell, and there's nothing wrong with that. The same principle applies in reverse, too. So, let's say that we had this elite headhunter here, and we wanted to target White Knight. It wouldn't matter if we were sacrificing a red creature and only paying red mana to activate the ability, or even if we only paid red mana when we cast Elite Headhunter. The only thing the game cares about is that the Elite Headhunter counts as a black creature, so it cannot target things that have protection from black. And another common area where this comes up would be with lands, like Cabal Pit. Even though the land's color identity is black, when we're considering its color, the game considers it as just being colorless. Because again, the color is determined by the mana symbols in the card's mana cost, and Cabal Pit doesn't have any of those. This means it would be perfectly possible to kill a white knight with Cabal Pit's threshold ability. Be careful, this does not mean that lands have a blanket immunity from protection. So, for example, you could not block a White Knight with Hive of the Eye Tyrant because if you take a look at its ability, you can see that when you animate it, it turns into a black creature. I made another video a while ago where I talked a little bit more about this sort of interaction and how it works, and I'd recommend that you check that out if you're interested in seeing a little bit more detail. But that's all I have for you today. How did you do? Join me again next time for another Daily Ruling, but until then, I hope you have a great day.